Not really sure what Richmond, Indiana is known for, except for Tom Raper's uh, Camping World Exit 49A and the Seminary of Earlham College. I know they've got other things, but those are the only two things I've ever known <laughs> about Richmond, Indiana. This game, you come out red hot, you score the first 12 points, and Earlham's been one of those teams, as we've talked about for years, that just is a thorn, but you put them away early. Right, and again, talked about getting off to an early start. I took the I took two box scores and enlarged them and put them on our on our basketball goal. There's a little crease there where I didn't know it was there, but you can stick the paper in, fold it, and it can sit there. One of them was Earlham's win over Center College earlier in the year, mm -hmm. and the other was Earlham's loss to Hanover two weeks ago by one. And I, no and I said we got to make sure that we come off come out ready to go, and and they responded. Uh, the, the Wednesday games, there's only a couple Wednesday games where we miss the very last class of the day to, to get on the bus. Yeah. You know, we drive up there, we, we grab some uh, Fazoli's up there in, in Florence Mall, y'all, and <laughs> arrive at 6, 610. It's not easy to drive 245 and 3 driving right there. and get off to a great start, but we, we did that. We got several guys making, really shooting tremendous from three. Four guys in shooting 40%. We had four guys in the uh, Rose Holman game. You had four players that were six of nine, two of three, three of seven, five of seven from three point range. And in this game, you still hit 16 of them. Yeah. I mean, the basket is the size of a garbage can right now. A big garbage can. <laughs> a very big garbage can. <laughs> and the passes that are leading to those threes, uh, other than Alex, Alex, we're trying to get him to, to get his threes off the dribble. but. The, the ball movement has been tremendous. Yeah. And, um, the, we didn't have, this was not a game where the starters are going to put up big numbers. Alex Jones, 17 minutes and gets 10 assists. Uh, that's pretty pretty darn good. 10 assists, one turnover. Yeah, but being, and the, the tough thing in this game, we'd look up in the stands, his mom uh, broke, her, broke her foot right before the game. Uh, so we go up to, to the upstairs we're giving everybody's assignment and uh, he said Alex you're guarding 22 and we said hey where's Alex <laughs> and he had gone up, gone up to check on his mom but uh, talked to her the, the day after and she said hey I'll be there Saturday everything's fine everything's gonna good keep on her. going so. good for her that's uh, the families that I've been able to meet over the last several years that makes it a lot of fun too Tristan Burgess he hit a three a moment ago his parents always like hey you gonna show our kid on TV this week? Absolutely. And, uh, and, he, and he is, when he gets in, and he has been a big, big plus, uh, especially with, with the shooting. Nice steal on the inbounds play. And it was, not to take anything away from Erlen, but they have traditionally been at the bottom of the standings. But to shoot how you shoot, 64.5%, I don't care who if it's against no one, that is very difficult to do. And uh, I, I can't think in the six years that I've known you and been around this program, I can't think of a team shooting the ball better than what you have over the last three weeks. We have uh, gotten hot and hopefully it will continue. We've, we've done some more, we've done some more work on our shooting, getting more shots up, but we've also worked on getting it, concentrating on making the extra pass. But you can see the quicker we're getting down, the better shots are there. I, I mean, Isaiah was, Pollard's pulling them out Bo, of Bo the corner. Shue with a pen. He had, <laughs> Isaiah, I said, Isaiah, you had two threes tonight. He looked at me and held up three fingers. He said, no, <laughs> no, coach, I had three. And then Tristan walks up and goes, I had two. I'm like, well, y'all need to do a better job. Bo uh, is back. <laughs> Bo Shue, four of seven from the field, two of five from three-point range, 10 points. Uh, in 15 minutes and it's also good to get some rest for your guys too because you have had double overtime games the Rose Holman game you, you went down to the wire nobody in this game had more than 22 minutes that, Cooper had 22 right. and I was hoping as we drove up there I was hoping that that would be the case it's one of those games if you're looking at numbers and, and trying to get people's averages up and, and all that this was a game the way we handled it because of uh, we're, we're sitting here uh, needing to go, you know, another 
another three, three and a half weeks of, of good solid basketball. This was a game where I was hoping we could rest some guys and we were able to do that. 40 bench points. That's got to be a mark that we haven't seen much this year. And because you had the early lead, you could go to the bench and, and get a lot of guys some playing time. Uh, you explode right out of the gate 12 nothing, and then it was yeah. Cruise control after that. We could have scored 120 in that game. Yeah, I'm I mean, sure. We really I'm sure. I'm and sure. Uh, just ended up backing off the press a little bit. Just a smidge. Just a four guys in double figures. Alex Jones only five points, but ten assists. Uh, he's he's doing it all over all over the place. And the game, 16 of 41 three pointers. You know, you set the record about a month ago, I guess, when you hit 23 pointers. You've had 19 and 16 and 16 and. It's uh, it has been a three for all out there and uh, it's it's been crazy 23 assists only 11 turnovers and with a month to go in this season in the regular season a serious case of congestion in the Heartland Conference <laughs> the top four teams are separated by one game and we have Hanover coming to the That's Beck right. Center. Next Wednesday's Mount, huge. Mount St. Joe coming to the Beck Center and then Anderson at the Beck Center yesterday so when everybody ahead of you is, is coming to your house. Yeah, that's right. That's not too bad. What's for dinner? <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't know. It's, I have nothing on that. Uh, we'll be right back when we have a little fun with some of the Pios on Trancy Basketball.